There may be calls for a ceasefire, but we're not seeing it here. In fact, the conflict is widening beyond the Gaza Strip. Palestinians were protesting, violently clashing with Israeli soldiers in the West Bank, another Palestinian enclave separated from the Gaza Strip. And these were some of the most violent clashes that have taken place in the West Bank in years. I was there for some of it, and it started with Palestinians throwing stones. And it is not just in the West Bank. Palestinians inside Israel, Palestinians in Jerusalem are holding a strike. All of this in solidarity with the people of Gaza, saying that what is happening in Gaza needs to stop. And here comes the tear gas. Now, Israel, of course, sees things very, very differently. It sees that it is fighting against Hamas, which it considers a terrorist organization. So a defeat for Hamas is a victory for people who want to see peace and stability in the Middle East. <laughs> And Israel says there is an easy solution to this. If Hamas stops firing rockets, Israel will stop the bombardment. Israel wants calm, and it does not want Hamas to dictate the terms. What Palestinians are looking for is change.